Hi everyone, Tammy Gavea here at Day of Days with Lindsay Godfrey and Paul Telfer. There's so much fun stuff to talk about because, okay, so here it is. Last year yeah. at Day of Days, yeah. I interviewed you and Greg. Yeah. And Sarah had just come onto the canvas. So I was geeking out because we love Sarah. Yay! We love sober Sarah and we love drunk Sarah. I love drunk Sarah. <laughs> I love drunk Sarah and I, I've, I've like made it very clear to the powers of be. I'm like, please don't ever make her an alcoholic because drunk Sarah is so yes. much fun. And I love when she comes out. I think you get to see, didn't I get, I've gotten drunk again and done. Oh yeah, there's another, yeah, there, there's, yeah. But yeah. I mean, it, it plays it plays out differently, but yeah. yeah. It doesn't work in Xander's favor quite so well the next time you get drunk, but yeah. I don't remember it. You'll tell me after. We'll work it out. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot, guys. <laughs> So I had my brain spinning because last year when you were paired with Greg, Sarah and Eric's storyline was intense. Yeah. So now you're paired today with Mr. Telfer. Yeah, we always joke that Sarah's madly in love with whoever's standing right in front of her. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell us, because the fans and the folks at Dish and Days yeah. love, like, are shipping you guys Yay! hard. Because they did Thanks, not like me with Eric. <laughs> <laughs> Interloper. I really was. Oh my god. We love it. I mean, we have so much fun playing together, but we're also friends outside of the show. Um, he's really good friends with Brecken, my boyfriend, and and has been. And so we have so much fun because we just get to go and play and be goofy with each other. And we both really love comedy, so I think we find a lot of moments to be funny and wacky and silly. And we're grateful that they let us do it. Yeah, I just felt so fortunate. I mean, I, I, I love being on the show. Um, I was very excited to come back onto contract and Lindsay kind of knew from the start she's like you'll see they'll put us together and I was like no every time they put me with a girl I end up trying to kill her or I steal her baby or I put her in a cage or I just mess it up every time she's like no 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 they're gonna you'll see you'll see and so like for the first few months I was like I was just waiting for the the penny to drop for the other boot to drop that like, oh no he's, he's just been he's been doing something evil or he's been doing this it's all a lie but then when I realized no he loves her I was like so relieved and yeah it's, it's so it's, it's been lovely well that's one of you know if you read romance novels <laughs> the uh the bad boy who is trying to redeem himself right. for the love of a good woman yeah and that's what that's what that sure. relationship is about so everyone's rooting for you yay we that's really we're rooting <laughs> well and also you know just selfishly i'd always wanted to get xander back to how he was when he first came on the canvas you know like trying to get into the business with his uncle and trying to like legitimize himself and yeah he has a criminal past but he's trying to like get get beyond it and so sarah is the ticket to all of that you know she's so legitimate and good and a doctor and, and moral and all of that so i think he, he just like he almost like there's a romantic way of looking at it, but there's also this almost like parasitic, vampiric way of looking at it, where he's like, I just want to feed off of your goodness and you will make me good. And his essential nature just makes it impossible because what you'll see over the next year, basically, is he does some of the worst things he's ever done on the show, but he does it out of this warped sense of, of love and duty. Yeah, yeah and protecting her. He's, he's very big on... You get very like territorial, very protective of Sarah and her feelings and Maggie, yeah. and um, it's very similar. It's funny because it is very similar. Like Sarah has this really tumultuous relationship with Victor, who's right. this bad man who's married to her mother that she constantly is being like, "Why are you with, are you him? with He's this terrible. guy?" Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm like, and meanwhile, I'm like, <laughs> "We're fine. Don't <laughs> don't examine this. We're talking about you." What are some fun things as actors that you know you can depend on each other for? Well, my biggest thing, honestly, this year has um, I, I used to really stress about the lines. It's a lot. It's a lot to learn. It's a huge amount of material constantly for all of us, and I used to overlearn and you know just out of stress of not wanting to get things wrong. And over the year of like you know really being back on the show, I've tried to get. Um, quicker and, and, and just more relaxed about that whole process and the big thing that's changed for me now especially in scenes with Lindsay is if I get lost or if I if I know I'm about to go off on a line I can just look in your eyes <laughs> and I know that you won't you'll fill the moment with me I, you'll never be like are you gonna say your line like you will no, like, you. if I miss a moment she will make a new one and catch me and, and vice versa hopefully yeah. and it makes the scene so much better because you're, you're seeing you're seeing that it looks like the 
the characters are thinking and they're they're not just like spout we're not just spouting our lines you know like we're really like in in the moment and so that's been been new for me on the show just because it's the first time I felt that that level of comfort and just relaxation on set because we we now have the shorthand with each other so it's like yeah, it's definitely a lot easier when you feel like you can just be there with somebody. Um, and we're very grateful, yeah, because we, we just kind of, we have the same work ethic and we like to run lines the exact same way and we like to, um, when we improv things, it's usually the, for a certain reason right. or whatever. But yeah, like we always catch each other. Like if he goes up, I'll take his line and turn it into my line or yeah. vice versa. He does the same to me. And also physical stuff as well. Yeah. It's like, it's a lot... <laughs> it's a lot easier to get punched or slapped or whatever by. Yeah. by Can we sick, talk about all the slapping that's going I'm on? Like, oh my god, yeah. I hit well, him you so much. Punched me. The, yeah. well, it, was, it was a dream. It was a fantasy, but still, it was the a great punch, punch. The punch was not written. <laughs> the punch was not written, and I. He said it would be so much better if she punched. So I emailed and asked if we could change it to a punch because it was a fantasy of his. And so I was like, let's do it. And I, but yeah, I smack him more well, than any other person. But Lindsay boxes in real life. <laughs> like she can actually throw a punch. Yeah. So it was know, really I good. My life in my hands there a little bit. Like if she was an inch off, I'd we be did it. on we, my back. We had one recently where there is no stunt person. <laughs> Because it was just a fake out. Like, it was supposed to be like a whoosh, and I was supposed to be far, oh, and yeah. I was too close, and I hit him, and I ruined the take because I hit because him. Because you started laughing. I, can, I connected and went, oh! Yeah. No, I was like, just, I mean, if you if you're really going like, to hit me, just hit me. It. It'd, it'd be on TV, it'd be great. So that was a real mark on your face? It was no. mostly my eye, as I remember. Like, you really caught some no, eye that, in there. This but. one hasn't aired yet. This will air, yeah. this was recently. Oh, we have yeah. more to look forward oh, to. Yeah. Oh, my God. So many times I hit him. <laughs> And I, hit hit him, and I hit him when I talk, I realize. I do that too. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I hit people when I talk. I do it to Martov too when I talk. When, when Sarah ever talks to Brady, I hit Brady's chest. But I do it to you the most. <laughs> well, we want to wish everyone, you know, again, I'm saying this at every interview, because 54 years yeah. of a show is phenomenal. It's incredible. You're matching up. You know, the soap gods have... Yes. Blessed you guys. Yes. We're so excited. We can't wait for more. It's rah, rah, rah. Yes, yes, yes. Keep thank going. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, no, we're just so grateful. Thank I hope you enjoy thank everything you. that's coming. Come on so our cool. show. Come we on to Dish and Day soon, please. I tell James all the time. I'll come and play. Yes. We, have, we, have to, we should go on together. We'll go together. Yeah. We'll go together. We'll go together. We'll make it happen. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you. Cheers. <laughs>